Yo, these two latest videos are doing quite good, dude. How many subs? Are <laughs> Wake up with the active face. Pop two pills with Gatorade. What's going on, guys? My name's Tabs, but of course you guys know that. And today, well, do I have a video for you? So I put up a post about a week ago asking what videos you guys wanted to see, and it turns out a lot of you guys wanted a cheat review. Now, Precision hit me up wanting some videos, so I figured why not. So yes, this is a paid review, but that does not affect my honesty whatsoever. Anyways, before this video starts, you guys can get the cheat for about a dollar or two dollars off with code tabs on checkout. I don't make anything from uh, you guys using my code, uh, but like I said, this was a paid video. Anyways, we're going to be looking at the cheat and something really cool about this cheat is that it's built into the panorama UI. So as you guys can see, I'm Supreme Master First Class, level 35 Colonel. This is just a background, it's pretty cool. Uh, but we do have our visuals, our misc, our combat, and all that kind of stuff here. And uh, of course, we're gonna go over the ESP a little bit because there's a lot of options, but there's a, there's a couple things that you might wanna do to make this look a little cleaner. So my personal setup for this cheat is what you're seeing on screen now. No glow ESP, nothing like that. We just have footstep, ESP on, skeleton, and name. Of course, for game modes where you're gonna wanna see guns on the ground, etc. You can turn on loot ESP and you'll find guns that are on the ground, etc. This is really good if you're playing the new Danger Zone map. Moving on to combat, we have a pretty clean system that goes by weapons, so you guys can see the weapons here. We also have a hitbox indicator, so you can do auto, which would be nearest. You'll have left thigh, right thigh, dick, stomach, chest, and head. And then we also have our smoothing, our aim RCS smoothing, and our aim FOV. Or I don't think this is smoothing, I think this is more of how hard it's going to be pulling for you. We also have trigger bot, and when you turn this on, you're able to choose your hitbox. And I believe the key is shift. We have rage mode, which as you can see, it'll just follow wherever he goes. And then all I have to do is pull the trigger. For misc, which is this guy right here, we actually have some pretty cool stuff like wide scope, force scope, no flash, auto pistol, auto strafe, grenade trajectory, which we can turn on, rank reveal, fake lag, event notifier, C4 timer, and bunny hop. To give you an idea of what wide scope does, this is it. It widens the scope and gives you a custom overlay. Moving further, we also have our skin changer, which is team configuration. So you choose the weapon you want to edit. So for now, I am on CT side and uh, we already have a knife as you can see. So we're going to go down and change the op here. We can change the item quality to anything you want. I'm going to go with default, factory new and the paint kit that I want. Um, let's have a dragon lore in stat track. It's not every day you see one of those, right? And there you go. Now the stat track doesn't actually count your kills. It just says one, three, three, seven, like most cheats do, but still not bad. Same thing for the knife. Now the config system is really nice because we have the trigger hotkey for your uh, trigger. I seem to have been correct. Now, one thing to note, these are only if rage mode is enabled. I just like how it follows them around. That's fucking jokes with rage mode on. All right, we'll turn that off here. So again, like I said, third person only works with rage mode. As I've seen fake walk hotkey is C. And of course you have your safe skins. Skins have been saved your save settings and then to wrap this entire review off in game you can click quick exit but I'm gonna let you guys know right now that the cheat runs perfectly you can see my FPS top left I am recording in 4k right now so me having just 277 frames at the moment is actually really not bad I do have some clips of this cheat in danger zone if you guys would like a danger zone video or a road to global with this cheat let me know in the comments down below guys anyways I would recommend the cheat just because of how cheap it is and it's a good alternative to cheats that cost something like $14 it has everything you need with nothing added to it that would be kind of too ridiculous like it, it does have some one of the bare minimums but it does have built-in backtracking and all that and it's preset for you so i would say if you're new to cheating this is probably a great cheat to start out with anyways guys my name's tabs and i'll see you guys on the next one later bros peace